Shabbat Shalom again. Shabbat Shalom una vez más. Uh, let's go ahead and open to the scripture this morning. Vamos a abrir la escritura en esta mañana. Uh, le damos gracias a Yahweh. We give Yahweh the praise. Give him the thanks. Because he is worthy. Porque él es digno. And we're going to be going to the book of Yeshayahu. Vamos a ir al libro de Yeshayahu. Isaías, Isaiah. 27. <clears throat> when you're there, you can say Amen. Yes, chapter 27. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go. Uh, we'll go ahead and start in verse one. We'll start in verse one. <clears throat> it says, "In that day, Yahweh, with his great, with his severe sword, great and strong, punishes Levithian, the fleeing serpent." Leviathan, or Le I'm sorry, Leviathan, the twisted serpent, and he shall slay the monster that is in the sea. En aquel día Yahweh con espada grande, fuerte y impacable, castigará a Leviathan la serpiente. Hoy dice Leviathan la serpiente que tuerce, <coughs> el destruirá al dragón. In that day, sing to her a vineyard of red wine. En aquel día habrá una viña placentera y el deseo de cantar acerca de ella. 3 verse 3. I, Yahweh, do guard it. I water it every moment, lest any hurt it. I guard it night and day. Yo, Yahweh, la guardo de momento a momento la riego para que ningún daño le sobrevenga. La guardo noche y día. So, vamos a orar. Let's pray. Father, we give you thanks. Te damos gracias a este día. Porque tú eres digno de ser alabado, digno de ser honrado. We praise you and honor you this day, Father, in this Shabbat, en este día de reposo, Padre, que estamos aquí contemplando. This day, Father, we have, that you have given us to take time to, to rest, to seize, que nos has dado tiempo de, de parar, de ser lo que nosotros hacemos, to stop doing what we do. But to spend time with you y pasar tiempo contigo, Padre. Uh, worshiping and praising you, alabándote y honrándote de tu palabra, Padre. So we give you praise and honor, Father. Tamo honra y alabanza, Abba. In the name of Yeshua HaMashiach, Amen and Amen. So, first of all, this chapter opens up talking about Leviathan or Leviathan. So, viendo aquí a Leviathan que está hablando la escritura uh, o está expresando Yahweh de que en ese día, in that day, when, he, when, when the scripture says in that day, in ese día, he's talking about the day of, uh, of judgment que viene, un día de juicio que viene. Uh, sobre 
sobre la tierra. Over the earth is judgment that is coming. But not only to, to uh, here basically, but to the, to the land, a la tierra, sino que específicamente a los moradores de la tierra. Because it, it is not the land that has sinned. No es la tierra la cual ha pecado. Sino que el hombre mismo fue el que pecó. Man himself has sinned. Adam has sinned. Ha pecado Adam, la humanidad. Uh, because if you notice that in the beginning, in the book of Bereshit, in Bereshit and Genesis, Genesis, um, when he cursed the serpent, maldijo la serpiente, he cursed the woman, maldijo a la mujer, pero al hombre no lo maldijo. He did not curse the man, but yet he cursed the ground. Maldijo la tierra, el polvo por el cual él vino. So, en eh, eh, las acciones que hacemos afectan la tierra. The actions that we take affect the earth. And, and here we, uh, you know, uh, we want to blame, like if it's, you want to blame, it's, it's the earth's fault this happens. Como que es la tierra la culpa que tiene. No, es el hombre mismo lo que hace o lo que ha hecho. What it does and it has done, it causes effect. To the, to the earth, a, a la tierra, le, le dijo, porque Adam, fuiste hecho, creado del Adama, you were created from Adama, from the dust of the earth, and there you're going to return, ahí vas a regresar de donde viniste, we are recycled back to the point of our creation, el punto de la creación, reciclados para atrás, we return from where we came, Um, so, but here he's talking about a judgment and he's talking about Leviathan. Está hablando de Leviathan. De que lo, 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 lo está hablando. No nos vamos a meter en, en mucho detalle. Eh, hablar de quién es o qué no es. Or what it is, what it isn't. Pero, sino que mirar. Que lo va a castigar. That he's going to punish him. And he's saying it's a fleeing serpent. Que es una serpiente que huye. In other words, it's... Uh, what does it mean to that you flee? Que que significa que huyes? That you're always running or, or getting away. And I'm all like... I'm all like I, I, I can say it's like... It's like you're getting away with it. Como que te, te, te escapaste otra vez. You know, many times we do things... And we get away with it. We think, pensamos de que, oh, nadie me agarró, like when the thief, like the thief breaks in somewhere and he steals, he feels pretty good because he, he didn't get caught, no lo agarraron, but he's saying, he's telling them, your day is coming, tu día viene, tu piensas que vas a huir de este juicio, you think you're gonna, you're gonna flee, From this, uh, from this judgment. But, but he's telling you, you're not going to flee. No vas a huir. Viene juicio. Judgment is coming. So, and then he also says, uh, punishes Levitian, the, uh, uh, so, so, we already read Levitian, the fleeing serpent, but it says Levitian, the twisted serpent. Dice aquí, le dice también la serpiente huidiza o torcida. I mean, serpents, we already know serpents twist. La serpiente se tuerce, ¿verdad? Se, eh, y todo, pero no tiene que ver eso, sino que su manera, its ways are twisted. Sus maneras son chuecas. Le está diciendo todo lo que es. So it's telling it what it is. And he also says where it resides. Where his home is from. De donde viene su, su, su casa. He said he shall slay the monster that is in the sea. Que va a matar o destruir el dragón que está en el mar. Si vemos. Es de que muchas de las cosas. 
in ciudades donde hay puertos, where there's ports, a lot of evil comes through the ports. A través de los puertos viene mucha maldad. Ahí en los puertos cerca del mar, close to the, to the, to the ocean. But here then in verse 2 and verse 2, hace un contraste, it jumps to like, like it switches stories, como que se va de un juicio en ese día viene, a day is coming, judgment, and then verse 2, it just goes to a different story, se va como que cambia la historia, dice, in that day, sing to her a vineyard of red wine, en aquel día habrá una viña placentera, el deseo de cantar acerca de ella. It's talking about a vine that's going to be sung to, que se le va a cantar en ese día. Una viña, a vine, uh, a red wine, de vino rojo. Y vamos a ver, todo eso son como, como si hace una, un título o dice algo, a title, it says something. And then, after that, it, it, it's going to give more explanation. Va a haber más explicación. Vamos a seguir leyendo. 3, verse 3. It says, I, Yahweh, do guard it. I water it every moment, lest any hurt it. I guard it in night and day. Yo, Yahweh, la guardo. De momento a momento la riego para que ningún daño le sobrevenga. La guardo noche y día. So you see, you see, like, who is that vineyard? ¿Quién será esa viña? Esa viña es su pueblo de él. It's his people, Israel. De que él cuida, que él is taking care of the vineyard. He waters, in other words, he sustains us. Él nos, nos da sustancia. Nos guarda, nos cuida. El verso 4 dice, Wrath is not in me. Who would set thorn bushes and weeds against me in battle? I would go through them. I would burn them together. Yo tengo ninguna ira en mí. Ni me produce salsa y espinos. Entonces, como en la guerra, la pisotearé y la quemaré enseguida. You know, have you ever seen like when there's war, cuando hay guerra, que ponen uh, alambre o ponen cerco temporal, you know? They put like these uh, wire fencing con navajas, with blades, barbed wire, uh, uh, bob wire. Uh, uh, ponen uh, diferentes uh, cosas para que no entre el enemigo, so the enemy doesn't come. He's saying, you think that you can put uh, thorn bushes so that I don't get in, I don't come through? Ustedes creen que pueden poner espinos para que yo no pueda entrar? Yo voy a pasar por ahí por como nada. Se van hasta quemar. Se van a consumir. They're going to get consumed. Because nothing can stop him. Nada, nada lo puede parar a él. Eh, para, no lo puede parar del juicio cuando viene. When judgment is coming, nothing's going to stop him. El 5. Or let... Me take hold of my strength and make peace with me. Let him make peace with me. O menos se enojan, me fortalezca para poder hacer la paz conmigo. Sí, para hacer la paz conmigo. You know, he's, he's saying, I'm giving you a chance. Nos está dando una, una oportunidad. He's giving us an opportunity to what? To make peace with him. Que hagamos paz con él. He always gives us an opportunity. Todo el tiempo nos da una oportunidad de que nos arrepientamos. That we, we have a repentant heart. And that we be right before him. He doesn't, he 
does not, you know, that's why he said in verse 4, por eso dijo en verso 4, um, wrath is not in me. La ira no está en mí. That's not like, that's not me. But you're, that's what you're drawing out of me. Pero es lo que tú estás sacando de mí que yo te dé. It's like, you want wrath? ¿Quieres ira? ¿Eso es lo que quieres? He doesn't want you. So, pero mira lo que dice el 5. Or let him take hold of my strength. Um, oh no, sorry, 6. Those who come, he causes to take root in Jacob. Israel shall blossom and bud. And they shall fill the face of the world with fruit. Aquellos quienes están viniendo son los hijos de Jacob. Israel echará capullos y flores. Y llenará el mundo entre, entero con su fruto. Dice, dice, los que vienen a él, dos, él va a causar que tomen raíz con él, con Jacob. See, many teach that he did away with Israel. Muchos enseñan que se les hizo de Israel. Pero no está diciendo él eso allí. Dice, yo te voy a, si tú vienes a mí, tú te arrepientes, you repent, buscas, haces las paces conmigo, you do peace with me, I'm going to graph you into Jacob. Yo te voy a añadir a Jacob que seas parte de las tribus. That you be part of the tribes. Uh, he didn't say that he was going to make a new tribe. No dice que iba a ser una nueva tribu. Sino que íbamos a ser injertados. We are to be uh, grafted into into him. And we see in in, in 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 revelations in revelations where where there's gates or doors que hay puertas en 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 la nueva jerusalén in uh in revelations and it says that that each tribe cada tribu entra por su puerta each tribe enters through its door so I often tell people what tribe you belong to, que tribu perteneces. Si no quieres nada con Israel, if you don't want nothing to do with Israel, I ask them, well, well, what tribe are you from then? How are you going to enter? I ask people, do you know how many, I tell them, how many gates is there? ¿Cuántas puertas hay en Jerusalén? Ah, uh, una? One? I said, no, you need to read your scripture. Tienes que leer tus escrituras. Hay doce puertas, dice, there's twelve doors. There's north, south, east, and west. And each tribe has its own door. Cada tribu tiene su puerta para entrar. You, there, there's no 13th door. No hay una puerta 13 que... Your own, it, uh, there's not one that says my own tribe. Mi propia tribu, no. Three doors on each side. Okay. Yes, three doors on each side. Three doors on each side to enter the, to the city... So, um, dice el siete, he, uh, has he smitten him or smote those who were smitten him or were they slain as those had slaughtered? Yahweh nos golpeará, golpeará a Israel como hizo con otros y golpearon a Israel. Y él no los matará como hizo con otros. You know, he's, he's saying uh, he's going to deal. He deals with us, but he's not going to kill us. Va a tratar con nosotros, y, pero no nos va a matar. Es para que cambiemos, so that we change. Verse 8 says, in measure. By sending her away, you contended with her. He shall take away by his rough wind in the day of the east wind. 
con expulsión, enviándolos lejos. Tú contendiste contra ella. Tú la apartaste con tu rocío viento, recio viento, perdón. Y en el día de del solano, nueve. Therefore, by the crookedness of Jacob is covered. And this is all fruit of the taking away his sin. When he makes all the stone altars like chalk stones that are beaten to dust, Asherim, sun pillars, rise no more. De esta manera de la iniquidad de Jacob será expiada y él removerá su pecado, produce este resultado. Él desmenuza todas las piedras del altar como polvo fino los postes sagrados y los pilares del sol ya no están en pie. So, all the idol worshiping, todo lo de la idolatría la está destruyendo y la va a destruir. It's going to destroy all adultery, idolatry, and adultery too, for that fact. Um, Let's read verse 10. Mon verso 10 dice, For the city of defense is lonely, a home forsaken left like wilderness. There the calf feeds, and there it lies down, and shall consume its branches. Um, so entonces, el, el 10 dice, Porque la ciudad fortificada está desolada, abandonada y desierta. Como un desierto, los becerros padecen y descansan deshojando sus ramas y dejándolas peladas. I'm going to read all the way to 13. When its twigs are dry, when its twigs are dry and they are broken off, women come to set them on fire, for it is a people of no understanding. Therefore, he who made them <coughs> has no compassion has no uh, no compassion on them and you formed them showed them no favor uh, cuando son su cosecha se seque es cortada las mujeres vienen y la prend, le prenden fuego porque están en el pueblo el, el pueblo sin entendimiento por lo tanto el que lo hizo no tendrá compasión de ellos el que nos formó no tendrá misericordia. And in that day it shall be that Yahweh stretches from the channel of the river of the Wadi of Mitzrayim. And you shall be gathered one by one, O children of Israel. En aquel día Yahweh triará el grano entre el río Fratis y el torrente de Mitzrayim. Y ustedes serán recogidos uno por uno, hijos de Israel. In that day, it shall be that the great horn is blown. And those who were perishing in the land of Ashur and the outcasts of the land of Mitzrayim shall come and shall worship Yahweh on the set-apart mountain in Yerushalayim. En aquel día soñarán una gran, sonará un gran shofar. Uh, aquellos perdidos en la tierra de Ashur regresarán también aquellos esparcidos por él la tierra de Misraim y adorarán a Yahweh en el monte Kadosh en Yerushalayim we see here that que el mundo in the world it, it, he allows things to happen él permite que va en God pero por la desobediencia <coughs> For the disobedience of the people. Por la influencia del pueblo. Pero dice que él está llamando a su pueblo. He's calling his people. A través de todo esto. Está, está llamando uno por uno. He's, he's calling everyone. One by one. He calls each and every one of us by our own name. Él nos llama a cada uno de nosotros 
por, por nuestro propio nombre. Porque Él quiere tener una, una relación personal. Y le estaba hablando aquí a Yehudá. He's talking to Yehudá. But in verse, in chapter 28, in, in um, capítulo 28, um, vemos aquí, in el mismo libro, in the same book, chapter 28, we're going to be finishing right now. Vamos a estar terminando. Look what it says here. Woe to the proud crown of the drunkards of Ephraim and to the fading flowers of its splendid com comeliness that it is on, on the head of the fertile valley to those who are overcome with wine. Ay de la corona de soberbia de los ebrios de Ephraim de la flor marchita de su esplendor orgulloso que está en la cabeza del fertil valle perteneciente a los sobrecogidos por el vino. Aquí él está hablando a Ephraim. Here he's talking to Ephraim, referring to the other ten tribes, refiriéndose a las otras diez tribus. También ninguno, es como decir, ni uno de sus hijos se va a escapar. None of his children will escape his discipline, su disciplina. Un padre que ama a su hijo, lo disciplina. A father that loves his son, he disciplines him. If he doesn't love him, he's not going to discipline him. Si no lo ama, no lo disciplina. You know, the word, you know, I, I met this, this gentleman. He was in his tw young, uh, 20s. Eh, conocí un muchacho de sus 20 y él dijo que él sentía que sus padres no lo amaban. He, felt, he said he felt that his parents didn't love him because, and asked him why, he said because he would go out drinking and partying, iba a tomar y daba de fiesta, and he'd leave and come, y no le decía nada a sus padres. His parents wouldn't tell him anything. So he felt they didn't care, so they didn't love him. Que no le importaban. Where they could have told them, you know what, this life you're doing is not good for you. Esta vida que estás haciendo no es buena para ti. You know, the word does say, spare the rod, spoil the child. Uh, que si, la, si no usas la vara, la guarda, si no la usas, se echa a perder el hijo. Because there has to be discipline. Este, eh, da, David, no, este, um, David, see sí, David, one of David's sons wanted to take his throne. Le quiso quitar el trono. And it's because David never told him anything. David nunca le dijo nada. Le dijo, ay, que, que chulo, amigo. Oh, he's so handsome, my son. He just said, oh, he's so cute. Está tan lindo. Y después le, que le estaba quitando su trono. He was then removing his throne, trying to take his throne. Así nosotros también necesitamos disciplina. We need discipline so that, so that, basically structure. The scripture teaches us structure. La escritura nos enseña estructura. Cómo vivir, how to live. And it's important that we live how the scripture tells us to live. Que vivamos como la escritura nos llama a vivir. Amén. Espero que, que no seamos como la serpiente torcido. I, I, I pray that you're not being twisted like the serpent or prideful or orgulloso because the judgment is coming and we shall be in it and we're all going to be weighed. Vamos a ser pesados y, y estamos sin excusa. We are without excuse. But he doesn't want to punish us. No nos quiere castigar. Él quiere que regresemos a él. That we return to him. So that he can nurture us. Para que él nos pueda cuidar y, y, y guardar. Y podemos dar fruto. 
and were able to produce fruit. So, let's pray. Father, we give you thanks, Father, for this word, Father. We ask that you bless each and every brothers and sisters. Que venía cada uno hermano y hermana. Que esta palabra sea bendecida, Padre. And that we're able to put to practice, Father, your word. Que pongamos en práctica tu palabra. Y que vivamos conforme tu voluntad y no la de nosotros. That we live according to your will and not our will, Father. And that others that listen to this word at another day in time. Otros que escuchen este mensaje otro día. También que pueda hacer un cambio en sus vidas. Let it be a change in their lives, Father. That they're able to come to repentance, que vengan arrepentimiento, and to accept you as, your, as their Savior, y que te acepten como su Salvador, y puedan vivir conforme la palabra, and they live according to the word. I ask you in Yeshua's name, in el nombre de Yeshua HaMashiach, Amen and Amen. I know that these videos are put on Telegram, to social and YouTube and on Facebook, Facebook, YouTube, to social and Telegram. And Shabbat Shalom again, brothers and sisters.